Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about how to multiply a fraction. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help, you use Minute Math. We're given this problem here, multiply and write answer in simplified form of negative 14 over 15 times 20 over 21. Well, <clears throat> we know we can break down each of these to their corresponding factors. Negative 14, let's put the negative just out here. We can deal with that later. 14 is, well, 2 times a 7. 15, 3 times a 5. Multiply that out. 20, well, that's 4 times 5 off the bat. And 21 is 3 times 7. Okay, so now let's go rewrite this all as one big fraction. Remember, Numerator times the denominator, or numerators multiplied, denominators get multiplied together. Go across that. What I did was just find the factors here of each one of the numbers to kind of break it down. So in the numerator, I'm left with a 2 times a 7 times a 4 times a 5. Denominator, 3 times a 5 times a 3 times a 7. And don't forget that negative. Now we want to see which values can cancel out. I have a 5 here. And a 5 here. Got it. 7 denominator, 7 numerator. Got it. Anything else break up? Well, 3's are already prime, and they don't go into either 2 or 4. So we're kind of done here. So what does that equal? I have a negative. I have 2 times a 4 over a 3 times a 3 is what's left over. Meaning, simplified now, 2 times 4 is an 8 over 3 times 3 is a 9. Don't forget that negative. And there we have it. Negative 14 over 15 times 20 over 21 is equal to negative 8 over 9. I hope you learned something here on how to multiply a fraction. If you did, make sure you like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. This helps us make more of these free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching.